One of the biggest challenges facing product development companies is balancing design responsibilities with time to market. Most organizations have a bullpen of amazingly talented engineers, designers, and scientists, yet still struggle to achieve corporate go-to-market objectives. This is not due to insufficient design expertise, but insufficient time to effectively integrate that expertise into a cross-functional development process. Today, development teams are experiencing an increase in responsibilities and performance expectations, yet without a corresponding increase in the most valuable commodity of time. How can this dilemma be addressed? Let's start with an outline of the typical product development roadmap. The design campaign kicks off after an internal stakeholder meeting to define product requirements, specifications, goals, and timeline. An initial concept is then designed, fabricated, and tested many times resulting in a failure, followed by an inconclusive root cause assessment and a vicious loop of redesign, retest, and refail. Until eventually, another stakeholder meeting is held to either commence a fundamental redesign or launch as is with concessions. When dissecting this roadmap at a more granular level, additional time sinks, or what we'll call barriers, expose themselves. It's these additional barriers that many companies fail to recognize. However, if quantified, actually reveals they comprise most of that overall development process. For example, prior to drawing up the baseline CAD model, collaboration across the various design disciplines is first required to approximate form factors, investigate material options, solicit industrial design feedback, and outline methods for power and software integration. Likewise, once the CAD model is created, what's the lead time on material and components? What's the internal fabrication time beyond that? And is the test facility readily available when you're ready to test? Lastly, how often does the baseline concept meet desired performance specifications? The default reaction at this point is naturally to validate the testing procedure, retest for another data set, collaborate with other engineers to question anomalies, and take a best guess at what variables caused the failure. In comes the painful iterative design process, where these three roadblocks reappear for every concept established. Here is where many design teams conclude concessions are needed to get the product to market. However, before that narrative can be taken to the stakeholders, more engineering time is spent in creating proper documentation and justification to defend that stance. A critical decision now needs to be made on whether to commence a fundamental redesign, launch the product as is, or worse, terminate the program altogether. For those that persevere, eventually a product is delivered to the market. However, sometimes yet another barrier surfaces and is usually related to an unexpected field failure after product launch. Customers deploying the product in an untested environment can create an instant fire drill for the engineering team to replicate and develop a retrofit course of action. This starts the development pain track once again. So, looking at these additional barriers, can you identify those most painful in your current development process? Can you quantify the impact on added time, opportunity costs, and go-to-market objectives? In retrospect, are these barriers something that need to be addressed? At RAND Simulation, we offer solutions that eliminate these hidden barriers, compress development cycles, and enhance design quality. We found these benefits occur when Early stage feasibility studies can be quickly conducted for confidence in design viability ahead of lead times and testing when testing is used for one-time validation instead of uninformative and time-consuming manual exploration, when engineers and stakeholders can actually see invisible performance characteristics to quickly identify design deficiencies, their root cause, and the necessary correction paths, when application notes are supplied with supported documentation around proper installation and use cases, and when innovation creativity unleashes stronger product performance and customer ROI.